everyone, and welcome back to Fallout's Food Review. Uh, in this episode of Fallout's Food Review, we're doing Oreos. We have, we have most of the uh, different kinds of normal Oreos. We have our classic regular Oreo. Oh, I'm sorry. Mega Stuff. We got our Double Stuff. Mint Thins, and then Mint Thins. Um, and with that, we'll go ahead and get started. That's so sad. That hurt to listen to. All right, I want my first Oreo. Oh, no, let's start out with our basic kind of Oreos. Now, I'm sorry for everyone who has to see this, but we did have to get the see it with Oreo kind of regular Oreos. Um, the kind sponsored by Lady Gaga, so I'm sorry. I'm also sorry for what we're going to have to see. Hopefully they're not broken. Oh, they're oh. actually... They're pretty good condition. They're not too bad. The product is pretty good at not breaking things. Alright, let's go ahead and grab an Oreo. <laughs> Oh, oh, I don't know why we're smelling. You know, I know exactly I, what they smell I, yeah, like. Yeah, they just smell so good. I just, I don't want these things on my table. They're gross. I don't like them. Okay, I baked them before. Oh, but I love the smell of oranges. It smells good. Mm-hmm. Alright, you ready to take it? Classic oil. Pretty good. I do feel though. But if you ever have more than one Oreo, you're gonna have milk with it. Or else. Something to wash it down. Yeah. It's kind of drying out your mouth. Or like some really. <laughs> like I was saying, it dries. It dries out your mouth. And it's kind of hard to not eat. To not eat it with some kind of beverage. So, <coughs> so for my first ranking, <coughs> worthless, normal Oreos, I mean by themselves, you know, if I'm not going to judge it with milk or in high quantities, it's, it's I don't know, it, it's not the best cookie, but it's not bad. I'll, I'll have a couple for a dessert maybe, I wouldn't, I wouldn't eat more than five. Even with milk, it just, it just, I don't know, it doesn't say right, fucks they're up my good. teeth. They're the classic dessert. Yeah, they're, they're the good. classic cookie. Yeah, but they're just, there's nothing special. So we'll just, uh, 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 okay. I think it's an easy beat here, uh, in, in my opinion. There's going to be nothing else in any of our tears. And for our next, oh god, uh, for our next one, first I'm going to do a quick palate cleanser. Scrumptious. For next one, we'll do double stuffed, and I have never had a double stuffed Oreo in my entire life. Really? Not much. Mainly because I think if you have more cream in the normal Oreo, it doesn't help. Because I don't understand, I feel like these were made for the people who like to twist the cookie and then just eat just the cream, mm -hmm. and then they, I don't know why you would do that. That's gross, and I think it's stupid, and I feel like this is who it was made for. And then just take one. That's what Mega Stuff is made for. I mean, that's also true, because they just stuck it more. Get off my table! It doesn't... I mean, it smells like less... Like less, um... It smells like more cream. Knock, knock. Yeah. <laughs> Dig it. Mmm. Okay. It's just a much smoother bite. I was gonna say. And it's much easier to get through. There's no like... Effort. There's no effort to get through it. It's just seamless. Hmm. <laughs> so for my next breaking... I can't believe they're having a rave next door right now. Yeah, it's so fucking annoying. So they know I'm found. I would say this is better than normal oil. Mm -hmm. But I don't know if it deserves A tier. I don't think so either. I think it's like B, B plus. I don't think there's enough of a difference to yeah. make it go up. Yeah, I think it's like above it, but not quite a full ranking above it.
You know you don't have to go directly above. We've got a whole thing. I don't like that. We have a whole board. I didn't ask for these. I need to do my pet blender. And for my next Oreo, for the mega stuff, which I feel, I feel if, it, if it's like the double stuff, in any way, shape, or form, come on. It's, oh my God, that's terrifyingly stuffed. <laughs> Is it not? Okay, look at this. It's a chunk. I hate how it looks like they legitimately just peeled off the layers of normal Oreos. Is this is this double, double stuff? So this is double stuff. This is mega it's stuff. It's a size comparison. Can I get a close up. It smells a lot like. Oh cream. no! Look, if you literally look at them with right. that close up, there is honestly two layers right. of cream. It in literally there. looks like they just it is picked split. it off and put it onto another one. It's just it's mega it's stuff. Original. I mean, comparing that to the original, you like barely see the, the cream. The cream alone is a full Oreo. That's just unnecessary and gross. So. I'm a little bit worried because I feel like the double stuff did it right, where it's gonna be like enough cream so it kind of makes it easier to go through, but not like overpowering. But I think this is gonna be overpowering. I'm a little bit worried. Okay. Oh, the whole cookie just got destroyed. That was right. Yep, no. It is, it is pretty overpowering. It's too creamy because it stays in my mouth too long. More than the Here's cookies. the thing. I think, I think there are people who like the cream. And those are the people who like split it apart and eat the cream out. Of them. And there are people who like the cookie. I feel like if you're just going for an Oreo, you get the regular ones. But if you really like one or the other, you're going to go for the mega stuff or the thins. That's fair, but I don't know. I feel like, because now if I'm going to go for an Oreo, I'm going for a double stuff. Just because it's easier to get through, it's kind of just you know, pretty good. But I genuinely don't know who would want this much cream because it gets to a point where like you get through the cookie and then it's just cream in your mouth and it's gross. And I don't like that because I, if I'm having the, I want both, all right? I want that combination, I want one to complement the other, not to be the only one I taste. Which is, yeah, I think oh. double stuff is like the perfect medium. I agree, I agree. That should be the normal standard for Oreo. But yeah, I don't know, I'm just playing. So for this making, I don't like it at all. I, I think it's bad. I think it's, it's just bad. not as good as the other one. I think it's bad. I think it's bad because I wouldn't, I, I didn't want to finish that one. And I would never have enough. It's a lot. It's so much. It's just so much more. It's too much with, cream. It's too with much the cream. big ones, you can really only get through like one or two. The lower you go, the more you can eat. I feel like. I mean, the thing is, I don't want to buy a full package of Oreos and not be able to sit and eat at least a few. Right. If I can get through three comfortably and be like, yeah, that was good. That was good. I can I'm done. Then that's a good Oreo. But that's, that's not something I can finish one. Now my teeth feel like cream and scrubs. Let's move our next Oreo. So for my next Oreo, we're doing thin squares. Oh, there's a post. It doesn't say lift here. How am I supposed to know this is where I'm supposed to lift at? I don't know. Ah, perfect. So classic thins, thins. I think thins are pretty good. But I agree. normal thins are weird. I like I, mint thins. I like the thins because they're... I like the thins because they're not... They're, they're a thinner cookie, too. Yeah. And it's... I don't know. It's not just that it's less cream. Right. Yeah. They're all together thin. And it feels like it's a nice balance. I agree. I agree. Okay. Mm. And you can just suck down an entire thin easily. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's nice because. It feels crunchier. Mm-hmm. I'm a big fan of crunchiness. Big fan. I honestly feel like the thin cookie is a little more flavorful. A little bit. Like, it's got a little bit more of that chocolatey flavor to it. Which I like. 
So for my next ranking, you people disappoint me. So I think for thins, I would much have a box of thins than a box of any other Oreo, honestly. Just so I just think normal thins are much better. So for that reason, oh, Yep, I agree. So for our next Oreo, we have our Oreo mint, just a regular mint. And I honestly, I have never seen normal mint Oreos. Without, I have, but I don't think I've ever had them. Right? I mean, I I've had them the thin. Right, because I think I, I have never seen normal ones like this. I mean, I also haven't seen a lot of the flavors. Holy fuck, that's, that's yeah, strong. Yeah, it's very pungent. That is really strong. Here, let's go and take an Oreo. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like mint chip ice cream. I'm actually curious now if I'm gonna like these more than things, right? Okay, okay. Interesting. Now, I don't think I like these more than the thins, because I think it's too much mint. But, that's not bad at all. No. Well, it's really dang good. I mean, it's better than the other one, because it's mint. Yeah, oh uh, yeah. And I think, I think a lot of people get mint wrong. They'll do mint as more of like sweet pasty mint. They did it more of like an ice cream mint. Mm-hmm. Are you just waterboarding that cookie? Mm-hmm. Why? I'm afraid. It's not as good in milk. No, Regular true. Oreos are better for milk. That's Mint true. ones, not as much. That's true. So for my ranking, I am disappointed in my <laughs> staff for <laughs> many reasons. <laughs> yes. So for Oreo thins, they're not, or, I'm sorry, for Oreo mint, I don't think they're better than the thins, but they're better than every other Oreo, so. Yeah, I think that's like the A plus. Yeah, probably. probably. Oh, oh, I'm at, uh, oh, I'm just gonna stand up this time. Oh, I'm just legs. Oh my god. Perfect. Perfect. Have we ever seen Foda's legs? No. At least in this, oh. this show. That's a, that's a leg reveal from Fred. You're welcome. Good. For my next and final. Okay. For my next and final ranking. What was that? Oreo. <laughs> well, I had a stroke looking at the <laughs> mint Oreos that combined with the thins, and I didn't see the thins wrapper, so I had a stroke like three times rereading the board. And then I just kind of believe you. <laughs> So for our next Oreo, we're doing our Oreo Mint Thins, the best Oreo, and these are the most smashed. They're gonna, they're gonna. Oh gosh. It. Ooh. That smells better. It does. Obviously, it's enough. more of a blend of the chocolate and the mint rather than right. just overpowering mint. It's not just mint, yeah. Oh, take it. Yeah, okay, right. Well, we're gonna do it. Okay, let my co-host one up. How did that not, not, okay. Oh yeah. Okay. The blend is nicer. It's not overpowering. Yeah, it's just easier to eat. And honestly, the thins, I think I like the thins more because I can just sit and eat them. Right, and just keep them. They're more like chips almost. Right. Yeah, the mint is so good. Mm hmm And it's super easy to eat. You need to bite right through it. It's got that crunchiness of normal thin. I'm a big fan. I think... Still not as good in milk, though. Still not what? Still not as good in milk. Yeah. Better um, eat... The mint ones are better eaten alone. With milk to drink. Right, because it washes it down with milk? Then it's good. 
So for my ranking, come here, Beezy. Beezy, Beezy, come here. Good girl, come here. You like a pigeon. I'm so for our Oreo Thins ranking, which, oh, oh, our phones, oh, oh, God. I, I would easily say that's an S tier. Okay. Out of or all Oreos, that's an S tier. And I think that will probably be the only Oreo S tier we will ever see, including in future episodes. Uh, but I think it's really good, and it, it's probably just, it's the easiest to eat. It's mm -hmm. got the best texture, mm -hmm. the best balance. Mm -hmm. It's an all around perfect cookie. Best flavor. Mm. That's true. So, for our final ranking, we have our Oreo Thins in S tier. In our A tier, we have our normal Oreo Mint. We have our Thins regular mint, uh, regular Oreo. In B tier, we have double stuffed Oreo and regular Oreos. And in E tier, it's mega stuff. Oh, oh my mouth doesn't feel good. It doesn't, oh, bitch, you know. That will conclude this episode of Fudge Food Review. And we'll see you guys in the next review.